YouTube, it's me Turfed, and I'm here with uh, kind of a guide and a, a heads up on a program I ran into recently known as Connectify 3.0. It basically allows you to turn your laptop into a wireless access point. Uh, I'm, I don't have my laptop with me, it's in the inside and everybody's using the Wi-Fi and I kind of came in here not to um, disturb anyone. But basically, it is a lifesaver pretty much if you only have a... Um, wired connection and everybody else has to you know take turns with it uh and my wireless router just recently crashed on me it was a linksys uh kind of an older model but um instead of buying a new one i kind of just stuck with the um land for a while and then um i just got fed up and looked up uh how to turn your laptop into a wireless connection now there's a manual way to do it in the uh, control panel, but I really don't recommend it because there's a lot of settings and BS to go through. So um, there's a program that pretty much does it for you. You can uh, set a password, name of the network, uh, choose which type of network you're sharing, whether it be a business um, that you just want to share files or an actual network. Um, it's all very, very kind of much, kind of done for you. Uh, but basically, you download this program, Connectify, you install it, you um, set up your name uh, of the, um, the Wi-Fi access point, uh, the type of security, uh, I have PSK, WPA2, SPK, or something like that, I don't know, um, where you can choose basically any password. Um, there's another security setting that uh, it has to be like a certain... I guess discombobulation of numbers and letters for the um password I like mine short and simple um and there's just no security at all so you can share with the masses um now I have a um Presario CQ56 um a Windows 7 laptop that um produces decent this um decent distance uh, that's a kind of a weird sentence but um I'm outside right now, and that's where my perception is. Still, kind of runs fast. I mean, the distance doesn't matter; it just matters on the speed of the network um, for this program. But um, uh, it doesn't slow it. The bandwidth sharing uh, doesn't kind of. It just really doesn't get slowed down. Whether you're streaming video on all the um, connected users on Wi-Fi, it's all just the same. So um. You install it, you choose which type of network you're sharing, what type of network you want to put out, whether it be LAN or wireless. I chose wireless. And then you just click Start Hotspot. And after that, it should show you a check, and um, you're good to go. And I guess you trial it with um, any smartphone. Uh, I've run into pro problems on an iPhone 4. Um, it kept saying something about the... Um, the network name being invalid but after a few more tries and whatnot um it eventually gave in and just let me connect um and that was good to go but it definitely works on my hd2 works on my sister's droid Ares. works on my sister's um cq60 a windows vista laptop and it works on my mom's blackberry torch um all the same speed all the same you know uh preferences um I'm not sure if you can kick people off of your network, but I figure if you have a password, you're good to go. But if you just get mad at somebody in your house and you want to kick them off the network, you, I guess you just have to turn it off. Because I'm not really sure how to ban someone from your network um, temporarily or permanently. So um, I guess you could change the network name is a way to do that and the password. Um... But definitely worth a download if your computer is Wi-Fi capable. It's basically tethering, but for your computer. Um, yeah, that's about it. Um, oh, and um, if you get an error known as UPnP, you probably downloaded an older version of it. There's a fix for that in the 3.0 beta version. Um, you probably downloaded 2.0. And that's when you've uh, downloaded maybe excessively over 10 gigs of data. I've done it mostly because I was doing something. Don't ask what. It has something to do with torrents, yes. But, um, 
Yeah, I mean, after a, a few, you know, hours of data gaining, I guess it gave in, and um, I got a few errors, and everybody else was kicked off, and I was kicked off, and, well, I wasn't kicked off, because I was, um, you know, using the internet, but everybody else was complaining about it turning off. So if you get that, there's a fix for it in the, um, at the website itself, I guess I'll put a link in the description as well as, um, a guide. And I may just redo this video with the actual guide when I'm not disturbing anybody. But, um, yeah, uh, definitely worth the download if you want to save money on not buying a wireless router and you're tired of just having one wired connection.